Hi Libra, how are you? And here I am. This is going to be your soulmate reading. Again, this was suggested to me to do it more often. So here I am. So with that said, let's take a look at what your soulmate twin flame situation is looking like. Again, remember that my readings have no date. They are divinely guided. Everything has free will and not everything is going to resonate with everybody. Also remember that these are general readings. This is not for a specific person. So please keep in mind that not everything is for everybody. Again, if you know you're not dealing with somebody, if you know that you don't want somebody back in your life, disregard this whole video because it is most definitely not for you. And with that said, if you're still here, it means that you know that this is for you. So with that said, let's take a look. Let's see what is Libra's one of the initials. Of course, I got too many Libras and this is not going to be for everybody for this for specific. So if it doesn't show up here, it does not mean that they're not your soulmate. It means that, I mean, I would have stayed here the whole video just showing you guys uh, letters, right? So let's see what is um, Libra's potential soulmates initials so i'm gonna put aside the ones that are like the same so until i get more so okay so dang thank you spirit let's see let's see so we got t t a b a i n o f T R K P. Those are the uh, possible initials of your soulmate. I always like to tell people, please keep in mind their first, middle, and last name. Um, and with that said, now we can go ahead and see what's going on with your soulmate connection. Let me move things around because I got a very small area. So uh, let's take a look. Let's see what is your soulmate connection, twin flame connection looks like, Libra. Also, I made this like two, two days ago. I like to make my own little cards. When Spirit tells me messages, I'll write it down and use it as an oracle. So, let's see what. Sorry, Spirit, just one or two cards at a time. So, the first card says, if I could go back in time, I would have loved you like you deserve. I would have hold you forever. I want to call you so bad, but what if you don't answer the phone? I am only, I'm, I only lie to myself when I say I don't think of you. So they like to pretend they don't want nothing to do with you. This person is very, very, uh, seems to be very proud, selfish in a way. I just want to hook up. I've never felt like this for anybody from anyone before. When I lost you, I no no. When I lost you, life lost its color. Sorry, I don't even know how to read. Drama, they just don't care. So I mean, your person is a piece of art because we have one side saying that oh I miss you, I love you, and the other one is like. Psh, I don't care like who cares so either or they really do not know what day it is and they don't know what they want or it's just pretty much a very 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 selfish very very immature energy of being very proud and not wanting to and not wanting to admit that they love you that then at the bottom here says a day at a time then healing takes time don't compare it don't rush it it's okay to be nervous, lost, it's not that simple. And then look at this message, Libra. It says, I was involved in a long-term relationship. I felt I couldn't get out of, but I did it for you. So your person was with somebody else um, at the time that you guys met. They, again, this relationship was, they were together with this person for a long time. And I feel like they got used to this person. And of, co of course, when you came around, where they met you, whatever happened, they realized that they did not love that person. They realized that they were, you know, having feelings for somebody else. Look at that. They love you, but there's a big influence that keeps you away. Then I wait for you. I waited for you so long. Missing you became normal. So it's like 
they used to mess you but they don't want to reach out to you because of pride and because they fear that you are going to reject them and if you say yeah i don't want this person like i said before why are you still here when i told you in the beginning is for whoever wants this person so if you did if you did stay means that you didn't want this person you're just too proud as well and like i said before my loves um <sighs> oh, forget it let's go back so let's see what's going on with this person let's see if we can actually figure him out figure her out also on the side note i'm getting a i got a tea and it's help it's supposed to help to lose weight i've been taking it for like four days i don't know i feel so skinny i don't know that that's i feel like j-lo like you know anyway it tastes horrible but i don't know let's see let's see if it does something you guys let me know if you see me you know looking like a model there then i can go to victoria's secret or something to walmart <laughs> i can go to the walmart section and be like hey i can be your model <laughs> anyways enough about me and my dreams of being a model let's take a look what's going on with libra's twin flame soulmate please and thank you oh let's see so we have queen of wands leo sagittarius energy the hangman in reverse the king of swords in the reverse look at that they look at your stuff libra jeesh the fool aries energy let's see look at that justice and reverse libra energy your energy loves and the five of wands in reverse the nine of cups and the five of swords in reverse and the hermit virgo energy here so your person look at this this is the seven of swords right your person in the past oh look i have this other light let me turn it on and let it be light so it looks a lot better so your person in the past was a player they were actually playing that person that they were dating to like they were not faithful <coughs> they were not faithful to nobody they were only faithful to themselves but that stage of being a, a player and being unfaithful and being that kind of person that you don't want to show to your mom they changed that they changed that um also i got the eight of ones here i just moved in i saw that um you're gonna have communication soon or yeah i see you're gonna have communication soon they're gonna reach out to you this is what it seems like it's gonna be so or there's gonna be some sort of movement you can take it however it best resonate um at the beginning i see that you don't bleh, that you're not gonna trust them you're gonna think that they're playing you but they're not playing you they actually changed and even if they told you you're gonna doubt them because for others of you they have told you this before and you go like no they're playing me just like they did in the past but it seems to be very different right now it seems to be that they are actually being honest with you it's like you make them uncomfortable here with the queen of wands right here and the hangman in reverse you make them uncomfortable it's like you make them very very nervous they find you stunning they find you very gorgeous they find you very attractive and very intimidating they could be a little younger than you even even if it's a little bit of like weeks or months it's technically a little bit younger than you they feel like you have everything together they also feel that they cannot deceive you or lie to you and they also like that you are very honest and if you like somebody you tell them if you don't like something you tell them so they really like your personality they like the fact that you don't hold back when it comes to what you want and what you don't want about a relationship or something but that makes them very uncomfortable and very nervous because i'm like they know if you don't like something you're gonna just tell them how it is with the king of swords right here they are very scared of making a move they are extremely scared to reach out to you or to show you something or to do something to make you know or to let you know that hey i still like you they are very very nervous like i said before you scare them you scare them 
with a fool right here they know that playing games and being this childish person and doing the things that they do with other people does not work for you and does not work with you this childish ways of like flirting and trying to be around you does not work with you libra and they know that and they get very freaking scared about that the justice in reverse and the five of ones in reverse they also feel like no matter what they do they won't impress you um like i said before this mind games that they used to play with other people or perhaps they tried it with you they realize that it doesn't work and the thing about your person is that they are where's the fool this person the fool and they know that they have to change that meaning that they have to change their game to get to you and they really don't know how to do that because they try to treat you like they treated any other possible romantic interest that they had but they face somebody that is not only beautiful on the outside is somebody that knows what they want somebody that is very mature is somebody that's not gonna play games like that so they're like oh my goodness how can i get to libra so again they try to get to you like with the nine of ones i mean sorry nine of cups right here you could also be dealing with a uh, water sign pisces cancer scorpio and the five of swords in reverse they try to reach out to you and like try to get close to you the way that they did with other people and like i said before it did not work and when they when it didn't work with the hermit in reverse they actually tried to stay around but they felt embarrassed and they felt bad they're like oh my god how embarrassing that i tried to treat libra like i treated these other people when i was dealing with a different kind of person and in a way they felt like you were mad at them or that they disrespected you in a way and that is why they left for others of you or that's why they stopped reaching out because they felt like no matter what they did or said they will never say or do the right thing again they get very clumsy around you and they just really don't know how to act around you not your fault it's just like for the first time in their life they met somebody that they really like and somebody that they know it's something that is not just a one night one night stand you know what i'm saying how does p uh i was gonna say pisces how does a libra's twin flame or soulmate uh feels towards them right now with the three of swords in reverse we got the three of pentacles in reverse i'm so nervous i got scared with him the ace of swords in the reverse the eight of ones and then we got ace oh my goodness the cups in the reverse there's a lot page of swords and the death card scorpio energy here so in a way libra they feel heartbroken they feel heartbroken i'm not saying that you cost anything or that they have the right to do that but they feel like even this could have been something that you chose somebody else or because you got tired of their stupid games you decided to move on because you never knew what to expect from them you never knew how they felt it's like it got exhausting it got old and you decided to be like okay sayonara bye bye adios papito you know and they also feel heartbroken because they feel like they messed up the connection they say like oh my god look at this i have so many chances with libra i could have done things so in so many ways and i chose to mess it up and they're very heartbroken and very upset with themselves because if some of you decided to move on or try to keep on with your life they this person is like oh my goodness i could have been with libra but look at what i did with the ace of swords and reverse and the eight of ones so there's going to be a very last attempt to fix things out with you they're going to try to reach out to you to see if they can fix it right now it's going to be something that maybe for you is not going to be that big of a deal because you go like oh i deserve an apology or this should have happened a long time ago but for your person this is very important or it's like very hard to do because they had to come back around pretty much beg for your forgiveness and try to see if you give them a chance with no guarantee of what's going on or what's the outcome gonna be like but this is an action that you're not expecting hold on be right back i'm back so like i said before it's something that is very important to them so they're very proud they're not used to like i said try they're not used to do this kind of things so 
there's going to be a one last attempt from them to reach out to you and to make it to see what's going on and when the ace of cups and the page of swords right here it depends on your reaction that is the kind of information you're going to get from them because we got the ace of cups and reverse and the page of swords so they really are going to see how you react to their text message or communication and when that happens that is like if you react to it pretty well you're gonna get maybe a confession or something of like how they really feel if you react very sarcastic and very like cold-hearted and like goodbye bro like you know that kind of energies they're not gonna tell you exactly what they actually meant to tell you and that's gonna be the end of it and you're not gonna hear from them no more because this person it is very very proud with a death card right here like i said before it's pretty much this person has gone through a lot and i'm not excusing them but whatever has happened to them has made them understand that you know that you can't leave things like this so they're coming back around like i said before just to end maybe how things like just to end the way things ended you know like just to pretty much fix it if it can be fixed and i know you guys tell me that you can't fix the past but you at least can get it make it better because if people don't try to fix things where will be everything us me you know like i'm not saying give this person a chance marry them instantly i'm saying like we understand that you can't fix the past but at least give them credit of like wanting to fix it then if you don't want to give them a chance or so like i mean nobody's put, like making you so what is this connection's blockages here with two cards what is the blockages of this connection okay so they have to choose over responsibility over love at this point i feel like they maintain or they give money to some sort of family members others of you this person could have a kid with somebody else and they're like trying to do their best to be responsible but the most majority of you this person is somehow the extent of their family and i'm not talking about a wife i'm talking about family as mom dad grandpa stuff like that like they're actually their culture or the way that they were raised is that hey you got to help the family and that is what they do they don't have time for love they only have time to work and this uh their family what i heard makes them feel bad if they don't give money makes them feel bad if they don't help around with bills so you're dealing with a person that in a way is being mentally taken advantage of from their family and that's why they don't trust a lot of people because they know that what their family is doing to them is not right but they just do it because it's family you know what is the outcome in between um libra and this twin flame soulmate connection please and thank you let's see what is the outcome my loves what is the outcome so we got the sun in reverse leo energy the emperor in reverse aries energy the six of cups right here so you guys have been um missing each other and not seeing each other for a while many moons that's what i see here many moons many faces here a year more run like up to two years for others of you you have been um thinking a little bit wrong about this person i'm not saying that they're not proud but it's not only what you think it is and i got people to tell me like i want to know more like i told you they're going to reach out and you're going to hear whatever it is that they want to tell you from them it depends on how you react to that message to like that reaching reaching out to you ace of cups let's see at the bottom here oh three of cups here temperance nature's energy so this look at that with a hero fun right here this is a very intense connection here for me when i see the hero fun i always uh, or most 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 of the time i realize that this is a connection that has been going on for different lifetimes like if you don't believe in soulmates that's fine but your energies have been tangled for a long ass time um you could have been married in a past life like past past life and time has gone by but you guys haven't forgotten about each other i'm not talking about energetically here 
So you guys have been waiting for this person, like I said before, many, many moons, and you guys have been very unhappy about it. Um, you had a little bit of a different perspective over this person because this person is very quiet. They don't do much to explain themselves, and you get upset about that, and I do understand that. But they don't want you they like the perspective that you have of them because they feel bad to tell you what's going on in their life they go like what if i tell this to libra and instead of like oh hold on what if i tell this to libra they think like i'm just like some like weak person or so and they don't want i keep on seeing on libra's videos that this person not always but whenever this energy comes around they don't want you to feel bad for them they don't want you to feel like you need to help them they feel like they don't need rescue and they don't want you to come ar along and just give them rescue <sighs> when the six of cups right here and the three of ones right here they've tried to walk away from this like i said before but they haven't they do have strong feelings for you still and they will like to come back around i feel like your person um i don't know what i said fisherman i don't know if something about water something about fish it could be a pisces as well like i said before but if not this person is going to come back around maybe where you live um because i feel like work because of work they're coming back around and they're going to try to reconnect with you as soon as they step on the state or whatever it is that you live something reminds them of you and that's when they're going to reach out like they're going to be like you know what let's see how libra is doing you know with the death card in reverse and the ace of cups in the reverse this situation of like not knowing how beautiful or how horrible this connection could end like this situation of like not knowing exactly what is next with this connection is actually coming to an end like you will have clarity and either or some of you are going to have completely closure from this connection here you're gonna be like done with them and others of you will have the chance to reconnect because like i said before here like look at that the whatever this is for you like the situation of like missing them and wondering like what is their life like what would happen if you guys were together like if they like me or if they like me you're gonna know all of that and you're not gonna be wondering no more and it's gonna be a celebration here there's also like a love triangle and third party situation but overall it's about celebration it's like ending this um nostalgia that you have this like heartbreak this unanswered questions of like what's good you know so overall is very very good i see number nine it could be september it could be nine months nine weeks date night so i don't know what about september that i feel like it's gonna be lit i saw nine five i don't know what nine five or five nine means so look it up let's hope you guys get closer soon and before i go forever i'm kidding i'm going to check i want to give you a angel card let's see for my beautiful libras and their beautiful and complicated twin flame let's see You got two cards and I have to read them. Dang. Okay, we got two cards here. And we got detox your friendships. Your abundance flow is being affected by the people with whom you're spending time. So be discerning about your associations and relationships. Choose to be with people who are inspiring, generous, and supportive. And then the other one says, take divinely guided chance. And we got two little kids, which reminds me of the Six of Cups. All positive change and successful ventures involve a degree of risk and you are ready to follow your divine guidance to new ter territories as you leave behind the which is comfortable, comfortable and familiar but, but no longer appropriate for you. You make room for new and more meaningful opportunities. Look at that. Beautiful. A lot of words, but I made it. So before I go, oh my God, look at that. Almost destroyed this. I'm going to give you an answer for, from this book. It's called the Book of Answers. So, Libra, I want to give you two seconds or more to think about any questions. Just don't even think about it. Just say it. And the answer to your question right now is going to be given to you right now. Look at that. Look at that. Ooh, hey, hey. One, two, and three. Look at that. Keep it. Let me see. Okay. Okay, I'm going to read it because it doesn't work. It says, keep it to yourself and i'm gonna give you a second chance another think about anything one two three and damn it i can't pronounce that 
it will be indivisible. I don't know what that means. And I'm going to give you another one because I am that annoying. And this is a brand new book. So I want to try it. Another one. Another one, Libra. Let's see. One. Think about it. Think about it. Two. And three. Remove your own obstacles. So those are the answers to whatever you were thinking about. Again, I think my son just fell. This is the end of your reading. <laughs> And he did not fail, ladies and gentlemen. So he just like threw a bottle. So that is the end of your reading. Thank you so very much for sticking around. Please like and subscribe. And I'll be back this week with more readings. Thank you so very much. You guys have a blessed night.